hello, beautiful. Long time no see, right? How's about you coming over here and giving no, me some sugar? Come on. <laughs> oh, money, come on. Oh, baby Garrett, it's so good to have you home. Mom, you know I go by G-Dog. Oh, what an idiot. Dad, what's wrong? Oh, you got here as quick as we could. I'm glad, I'm glad. Dude, D3PO! Where did you get those thrashing threads? You don't ask. Crazy. I won't. I won't. Oh, cool, Brats. Dude. Dude! Good morning, everyone. This is Mr. Crispy Baker. He's here to talk to you about my will. Your will? Dad, are you dying? Yeah. His liver's failing, his kidneys, his heart, even his colon, everything's failing. He may only have a few days. So you mean I might not actually have to get him a present for his birthday this year? <laughs> Dude! Settle down, everyone. Is that too hard? As you know, your father has acquired a substantial amount of wealth. In his will, he has made sure you will all be very well taken care of. When the time comes, we will meet up again, and I will inform you of all the details. Die, sucker, die! What? Get off your phone! in a small town on my front porch watching MTV then she walked up on me with a short skirt man I dropped my key I said do you want to take a ride she said yes I do let's cruise we jumped in the car and pumped up the radio hit the dirt road and the dust was flying we were riding by Bonnie and Clyde uh, with the wind blowing hard inside I can't help myself but I love these three Money in my bank. I'll get Look here, you got 48 hours to give me my money. What you want to do about Mr. Drug Dealer, dude? Smoking that that stuff again. Oh, look, you have to try one of these. 
It'll make you feel real good. Yeah, what's the worst that can happen to me? It kills me. <laughs> so what do I do? You smoke it. Oh. <laughs> no, no, no. I have to light it first. Ew. I go by G Dog. Danny? I didn't inhale. I didn't inhale. Gnarly. <laughs> uh. This has been a real bad day. I am not cleaning him up. You ready to order? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, um, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> so, what can I get you? I'll take coffee, black, please. Okay. And you? Um, you got any uh, baked chips? Aren't you baked enough? <laughs> He'll take black coffee mm. as well. Okay. All right. I'll be back with your coffees. Yes, ma'am. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm. You do realize Aria is my son's girlfriend, right? It's chill out. I'm just checking out the goods, you know. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Man, I can't believe Dad is dying. Um, well, about that uh, Danny dude, uh, when do you think he's going to, you know, I mean, uh, <laughs> when's he gonna, you know, uh, kick the bucket? Could be tomorrow. Could be a week. Even a month. Nobody knows. <laughs> oh, it's too long. <laughs> what? I mean, <laughs> that, that's not long. I didn't realize you were taking this so hard. Yeah, it's hit me pretty hard. It's gonna hit me pretty harder in a minute or two. <laughs> what? Here you go, boys. I made it fresh just for you. <laughs> yes, ma'am, I'd like to get fresh with you. And do you have an omelet? Because you're making me egg excited. You know what I mean? You're <laughs> such an idiot. <laughs> In case he dies tonight. I, mean, I know how much he likes pink. You are unbelievable. Get out! Oh. Oh. Must come from your side of the family. What? Hey. Who would have ever thought me and my dad's maid <laughs> together? Not to mention carrying your baby, Mr. Childers. Well, if everyone is ready, Mr. Bacon will read the will. <clears throat> I, Daniel Childress, being of sound mind and body, do hereby leave the following upon my death. To my only grandson, Danny Childress III, I leave all my wardrobe and five million dollars, if you will never wear that ugly tie-dyed thing again. To my wife, Cinnamon, I leave both our home and our beach home in Hawaii to you. I am also leaving you two million dollars. It would have been more had I not found the video of you dancing for the pool boy. To my firstborn son, Danny Childress Jr., I leave my Rolls Royce and five million dollars if 
you can keep a job for more than six months. To my youngest son, Garrett, I leave five million dollars and the deed to your own dispensary in Colorado. Now, in sight of the fact Garrett managed to get himself killed by running in front of a bus after hearing a car backfire, the remaining monies will be divided between the two remaining children. You mean the son and the grandson? No. I mean two remaining children. He is also leaving $10 million and ownership of Childress Enterprises to his one and only daughter. There was only one stipulation placed by her mother on her deathbed. The daughter was not allowed to know who her father was until after he was deceased. His daughter and your half-sister is Nadia Eleanor Childers.